We're in, baby. That hit the side of my truck. Oh, oh. Gigantic. Such a beautiful place. Oh, yeah. So fast. What is up, G Squad? Welcome back to another awesome video. If you could not tell, we got a whole lot of garbage behind us. We are almost officially out of the old house. Right now, though, what we are going to be doing in today's video, if you cannot tell by the title and thumbnail, we are actually going to be moving the fish and the pond over to the new place. Super excited to see how this whole transfer goes. We got uh, we got Mr. PC in action over here. We are just going to try to siphon some of this water out of here into here. How that taste? Fishy. <laughs> but to say the least, all these fish have gone absolutely gigantic I'll give you a better look when we get them inside of this big old cooler we're gonna get the water inside of this cooler and then I'll pick the camera up when we're transporting the fish from the pond inside of the cooler now I feel like I must say this before I start to net and have Paul pick up the camera it probably looks like an absolute disaster behind me but like I said it, it, it it's literally what it is it is a disaster here so just don't don't think that I uh, keep my place looking like that I promise it's just a whole part of the move and we've got a whole lot of stuff here if you uh, if you haven't figured that out. It's it's pretty hectic. I, I hired Paul to come work work the day over here with me. Yep. Let's get the net, bro. You ready? What am I getting paid per hour again? Uh, just a couple of fish or something like that. We'll right. figure it out. I don't think you're filming for Gio today. So everyone, if you see any mistakes in the filming and the making of this video, blame me, not Gio. Back at ya. All right, G-Squad. Let's get right into this. Oh we got gosh. the net. So I don't know who we're gonna start with first. I'm guessing these uh koi mamas. All right. Double whammy. That's a three for one. Three? Oh yeah, yeah three. three. An Oscar and a koi and a goldfish. Coming over here. 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 We've got a monster. It's a Skeletor. If you guys remember that, it's a huge koi. He was goldfish. He was uh, like our little test dummy to see if our water was good, like a year ago. We got the little albino Oscar. See you later, buddy. These guys are gonna be hard for sure. We got a little baby Mr. Beast. Our little hybrid tiger shovel nose, red tail catfish. Buddy's trying to spike me. There he goes. Oh, yeah. Future monster right there. Future monster. Let's go get this little puppy dog right here. I can literally grab him probably with my hands if I wanted to. Come on. Come on. Oh. Whoa. Right into the net. 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 And look how big that thing has gotten, dude. It's huge now. Holy cow. That is a little red tailed catfish. Not so little anymore. Getting very big. Up next. Up next, we're gonna see if we get one of these crazy tiger. Tiger shovel noses. There we go. Holy. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Those guys, we're gonna, I'm not gonna show you much because they get super stressed out. Maybe when we're moving them from this back into the pond, I'll give you guys a better look. Oh, one. snap. Oh, yeah. How do I unplug that? That's not good. How do I unplug that? How do I? Just, uh. Just let it. <laughs> Holy cow. That thing is huge. Those guys, we got literally like this big. I think we got all those from uh, pet supermarkets. We went on like a little drive around whole South Florida looking for for red tails, but we just kept on finding these. Oh, let's get a scoop. Oh yeah. Oh, I don't yeah. know if I got that. All right. Sorry. Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> got another huge goldfish right there. Huge koi. This one literally just looks like a regular carp. Look at that thing, dude. Look at the scales on that. It looks fish. like a little of a carp. It does look like. Well, I mean, I guess it is a carp. I mean, yeah, they're in the carp family, but they're just colorful carps, brother. Oscar. Just the Oscar. This guy has gotten so much bigger than the albino. Oh. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, you're in. Check him out right there. Look at all these fish. We got one little koi left. Look at him. That tiger shovel nose is just an absolute maniac. Look at the colors on that. Such a beautiful place. Oh yeah. It's another koi. Right there. Now we've got... I mean, dude, they're like lightning. They're literally... So lightning. fast. 
Little hand grab. Nice regular pleco going in. Oh, see you later, brother. Hey, that tiger shovel nose in the back. Chocolate albino. Chocolate albino. Ugh. Pleco? Yep. Take a look at that thing. Wow. That's Such a weird looking fish. Very pretty, though. Yeah, it's so cool. He's kind of got like a little Birth black mark. star right there. Yeah. He's got the VA has cichlid. God, he's moving. Yeah, these guys have gotten. We'll show them when we get home. Definitely. Definitely get you guys a better look at all the fish when we're home. We are. Uh, we're moving on a, on a schedule here. We've got to be home before the sun goes down and it's about 5 o'clock. See if I can maneuver this. Meow. Money. Uh oh. Oh, gosh. One sec. Now you can actually get a good look at that shovel. Look at that thing. Oh, you hear him? Yeah. There's a couple I thought cichlids. Thought was gonna be cool. There's a couple cichlids left. Oh my Holy. goodness! And look at all the fish in the bin right These now. These might be worse than the damsels or the fish transfer, bro. Okay. Is you good, bro? I'm good, bro. It's a nice VA. Huh? Caught these down here in Florida, bro. Isn't that sick? Beautiful. What we need to do is get the sand out, quickly grab this pond, put it in the truck, and head out. I'll see you guys back at the new house. How do you feel about that one, bro? Uh, could have went a lot better, but I think we got it done. That's all that matters. We're in, baby. That hit the side of my truck. And uh, big old dent. Nah, you're good. Solid. Clean, eh? Yeah. We are here. We are at the new house. We need to unload this big old pond. Oh, yeah. Fill it up and get those fish out of that cooler. We are filling with water. This is gonna be a temporary spot for the pond, I believe. But uh, wow, what a day. He is uh, filling. Of course, since this water obviously has some chlorine in it, since it's coming straight from the hose, we got the uh, API stress coat. I'm gonna put half that bottle in, and then the rest when they're inside. A little bit more than half, but it's gonna do. A couple of these fish are looking a little stressed out, so I'm hoping everything is a-okay. We're trying to get this thing filled up as quick as possible to get them out of that cooler and into their pond. Fingers crossed here, fingers crossed. It is time to put some of these fish inside of the, uh, the pond that is currently filling up. Let's mention this is temporary, by the way. This is temporary, so like I said, you guys gotta keep on watching. Should you give them the sneak peek of where they're gonna go? I think I might have said it in one of the videos I've just filmed recently. I think we're going to be putting the pond in the garage. In the garage. Yeah, I think we're going to do it in the garage. It's going to be baller. Anyways, it is officially that time. Like I said, I know the pond is not fully filled yet, but uh, here's that one fish that I said that looked pretty stressed out, so I think we're going to just add him on in here first. Beautiful tiger shovel nose. There he goes. We are keeping our fingers crossed for him. He is uh, hes definitely a little bit stressed out right now, but I'm sure it's very normal with a huge move like this. They've never been moved. You guys That's the one that got his fin stuck. You guys got to remember that these guys have been in this pond since they were like wee little guys. So we're hoping that he's going to... I mean, he's looking a lot better already. Yeah. He's definitely swimming. All right, sweet. Next, uh, let's try to... Maybe we'll just catch a nice little... Whatever gold. gets in your hand. Whatever comes in the hand. We got a beautiful goldfish. Look at the size of... Oh. Oh. Yeah, there buddy. you go. <laughs> we're going to come down, grab this huge koi. These guys are getting gigantic. See you, buddy. Come up here. We'll grab a little pleco. Okay. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. A little whoa. pleco action? Yeah, a little pleco action. Trying to spine me there. Put him in the pool. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, buddy. Taking off. Now there's no sand here, so he's going to go to work on all that like algae on the bottom, so... Get the sucking. <laughs> we got another little goldfish right here. I mean, I shouldn't say little. These things are massive. Ch Dude, seriously, he took a nice little. <laughs> oh, you pooped it. on your finger. Right in. Let's go, little baby. Uh, little baby beast here. What's next? What's next? Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful. Uh, red tail catfish. Mm. Mm. Oh. You hear that? That's a whoopee cushion. There you go, buddy. Look at him go. 
Dude, it honestly looks so much better without the sand. Like the blue that just yeah. makes the fish kind of pop. You can really see them. Let's get a... Oh, I almost got a two for one. Look at how beautiful that albino Oscar is. So bright. Pretty fish. Very pretty fish. It's pretty crazy fish. how bright that... Oh, oh, oh. At least, it's in... at least it's inside of the pond, not on the uh, pavement over here. What else do we got? We got... This guy's really cool. One of my favorite koi's. Oh, yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Super slippery fish. Look at how, like, shiny that thing is. So long, buddy. <laughs> Tiger Oscar? Pretty delicious. Look at that fish. Looks like lava. Look at that fish. See you later, buddy. Two for one spesh. Swim right into a... All right. Never mind. A one, a one for one special. Got the uh, beautiful Vieja cichlid going in. Look at all the fish. Schooling up, swimming around. We got Skeletor going in. Dude, look at the size of that thing. Beaut. I don't know who's grilling, but... It smells sure good smells out here. It smells good out here, dude. I think it's one of your neighbors. <laughs> who's next? Look at that catfish got me, dude. Oh. Am I gonna be okay? I don't know, dude. You might catch a disease. Come here, buddy. Come here, little cutie patootie. Dude, Ow. dude, you're grabbing him. Brother. I gotta like grab him just from the front yeah. and like close the fence. I'll wait till he gets in there. Right. Look at the colors on that guy. Ah! We'll be here till 9 o'clock at night. Look, I'm not... I'm not a professional like you, alright, Paul? I catch lizards and snakes, bro. I'm not slippery little fish. This guy's actually starting to get his color. See the orange coming out? Yeah. See ya, buddy. I want you. I'm so scared. Go, go, go. When you grab him, just... Wanna <laughs> <laughs> show you how to grab him? Yeah, teach you a thing or two. We got the PC special. Here, hold again. Oh, we've got uh, we've got Mr. PC over here doing his profession, grabbing these uh, catfish and look at him go. Wow, you made that look easy, bro. You made that look easy. You gotta fold the fins down. I'm disappointed in myself. Or you just get right behind them. You can get behind them. These guys are a lot harder, but because they have another spike. If you can get like this without them murdering your hand before. They, they don't really freaking mess around these no, things. No, dude. It's no joke. It's no joke with those things. I just tar with one hand. We're we're gonna leave it up to him. Do your thing, brother. Alright. Once I can get under the belly. Oh, it's so easy, dude. It's so easy. Yeah. Okay. Look at that fish. Here you go, buddy. Dude. Oh, yeah. Good job. We got one last tiger shovel nose going in. Yeah, he, he almost I, got you there, huh? Yeah, he almost. He almost got you there. <laughs> you gotta, like, get him without a net. It's kind of tough without the net. Difficult. Look at the bars on that thing, though. It's really, really such a beautiful fish. Dude, those fins will murk you. Murk you, dude. Yo, good job. Thanks, man. You wanna, might, might as well just grab the last couple fish. That was easy. Two koi. Two koi's going in. And we got the uh ah. oh. <laughs> Let me take a look at that uh chocolate albino. Beautiful Perk. fish. These guys will live forever out of the water. It's actually they, they really do because they breathe air. Dude, I found one of these on the bank of a pool, like a pond before. Uh-huh. And it was, it was so dried up that its eyes were in its head. No way. And I put it back in the water and it took off. <laughs> must have been out of the water for like hours, bro. <laughs> Someone must have caught it and they're like, oh, this is an invasive species. Let me kill it. That's crazy. See you, buddy. There's all your fish, man. There we go. We've got all of our fish. We've got the Oscars. We've got the red tail. We've got the hybrid, the tiger silver nose. 
and all of those koi fish. We also got the two VA hit stickers over there. This guy already looks a hundred times better. He was one that I was a little nervous about. We got the big old puppy dog right there. Hey, buddy. Look at him go. Dude, are those not just your favorite fish? I love them. You just like, can't ever go wrong with a red tail. They just look like cute bulldogs. They're just, yeah, they, they literally remind me of a bulldog. A little bulldog. Well, hopefully you all enjoyed that crazy, hectic little scene of us trying to grab those fish. I got literally spined by one of the catfish, but I mean, that is that. They are now inside of their pond over at the new house and I couldn't be happier. Big shout out to Paul for uh, giving me a hand. Couldn't do this without him because we needed his big old monster truck. So, uh, big thank you to you. No problem, baby. And uh, with that being said, everybody, hopefully you all enjoyed today's video. Make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe, and don't forget to hit those uh, notification bells because we've got a lot of content coming for you guys here pretty soon. So uh, like I always say, stick around, and I'll catch you guys on next episode. Peace out, everybody.